current video i am going to share what is crowd funding how you are going to fund your business how you are going to elevate the profits in your business your business is going to shut down in upcoming 2 or 3 years no matter how many initial customers you have no matter how much profit you are making in your business right now you are going to lose because you are not able to keep up the momentum you are not able to keep up the inventories so this is the second part of how you are going to fund your business in the previous video i shared when you need to fund your business how you can create a pricing point how you can charge 10x amount of the same product available in the market and the last point is how you can bring a outsider investor plus convince that outsider investor to invest in your company but in the current video i am going to share what is crowd funding how you can utilize good debt bad debt are going to understand the one caveat to the debt when you are going to lose in the business and the last point how you are going to fund your business how you are going to elevate the profits in your businesses so let me introduce myself i am pranshu agrawal elite sales expert and social media marketing agency owner let's coming to the topic straight away which is crowdfunding kick starter must be your favorite website in this scenario not only it will help you to generate huge profits in your initial journey plus to fund your business in addition to that you are going to understand the how you can make fans for your product or services so coming to that thing you need to go to the kick starter website you need to list out build out your profile list out your product or services over there and first you need to understand the three step formula to get fans plus profits plus funds for your business through kickstarter.com first point is you need to create a video about yourself a short video concise video which is showing what you are doing why you are doing what you are going to do in upcoming time and how you are going to bring transformation in other people's life through your product or services plus in this video you must invoke some emotions so your audience can understand that you are uh, getting money to bring some transformation in their life second point is you need to share that kick starter campaign with your trusted friends you need to grab your first 10 customers you just need your some personal contacts fans relatives who are interested in your product or services so you need to share that kick starter campaign with your close ones who is going to share this with their networks with their known people so you will get some initial customers through them okay and the last point is you must have a micro influencer contacted with you yeah that person that micro influencer must have at least 10k followers who is constantly engaging with his or her stories plus post so when you want some initial kick out in your business you can use out that micro influencer to get that initial kick in your business so when you utilize that micro influencer and you make them advertise do a promotion video about your product or services in which that person is stating to his or her audience 10k audience that how this product can literally solve the issues of their audience then there will be much higher chances that they are going to purchase your product or services because that person already has a credibility in the market authority in the market and already people trust that person so when that person is speaking about your product or services up to a huge audience that audience is going to know that person is helping out and bringing the transformation through that product or services and that's how we are going to overcome our challenges then that people will crave for your product or services second point you need to understand the difference between the good debt and the bad debt yeah most people take debt as an advantage in their business and they roll out their businesses and generate huge profits while 87% of the people go into the bad debt they need to shut down their business and they need to file the bankruptcy why this happen because they don't understand how they need to use those debt so when you are not agree with that kickstarter.com that uh, you are going to share some shares of your company instead of some money to get some money from the investors you can utilize debt so when you know that uh, you are going to invest the money and you can make x amount of profits with that money then that's a good debt you already know how to generate money and how to do the things so when you are taking debt when you are taking out the loan so you can pay off that loan easily but if you are just taking out the loan that i will invest that money in my business and i will grow it to that much you are going to fail because you are just imagining out the things you don't have a road map you don't have a practical road map to follow on so it's really important to have a practical road map predictive sales in the mind that's how you are going to utilize that debt so always take out loan i usually say this thing and usually implement this in my life when i don't have money so what i'm going to do i'm going to use another people money definitely and loan will be a better option if i know how to scale my businesses i know how much sales i am going to generate in my business right so 
you understand the difference between a good debt and bad debt always opt good debt otherwise you are going to fail in your business third point is one caveat to the debt just like i said 87 percent people ruin their businesses and file bankruptcy by shutting down their businesses because they don't utilize debt in a good way so when i am taking uh, taking out the loan although the loan interest is too high i can suggest you a website which is cabbage.com that's not a promotional video about that but this cabbage.com can help you take out some loan for your business but the interest rates are quite high 20 to 30 percent but in a starting you don't have that much option and you can go with cabbage.com so what we were talking about one caveat to our debt so if you are taking out the loan investing that money in your business and you are just speculating about the things let's suppose i'm a person who knows about the business who knows about the sales how to grow the things and everything right but when it's come to the cryptocurrency i don't know about it like how it works how it generates money how the percentage spikes and everything right so i don't know that thing so i'm not comfortable to invest the money in the crypto and even if i'm investing money in the crypto then it's just a gambling part because i don't know how this works so i'm not going to make money maybe i'm going to make the money but that's not a conscious step so that that's what i got speculating so you are doing the same you are taking out the loan you are speculating about the business and ultimately you need to file the bankruptcy so don't take loan if you don't know how to cover that loan out in the future so i have a formula for you if you know about the predictive sales like this is the amount of sales i'm going to generate i have systems i have peoples and i'm going to align the things in such a way that i'm going to make that amount of predictive sales in upcoming time then you can take out the loan you can use that loan and it will become a good debt for your business because you are generating money you are paying off the loan you are enjoying the things you are scaling up the business right in this scenario you just need to understand the predictive sales must understand your business must understand about your target audience in which season they usually buy you need to find every metric so education based marketing will come into that role to understand education based marketing uh, one video will pop out here in the i section you can watch after this video <laughs> when you understand education based marketing when you have every metrics you understand the predictive sales i can generate in my business by taking out the loan on my business so that's how you are going to make it okay but if you you are just gambling the things if you are just speculating the things then trust me you are just going to file bankrupts you must understand this simple step that debt must go in scaling inventories not in the other departments of the business because you took out some loan you need to pay off the interest you need to pay the principal amount and if you are not getting money on that loan then you are going to lose so i always say your money will go in the scaling inventories which will bring more profit so you can pay off the loan you can pay the principal amount plus enjoy while doing your business now here you need to understand when and how you are going to fund your business you need to understand on what parameters i need to decide now i need to fund my business just simply remember money is just an amplifier if you have a bad idea it will amplify your bad idea if you have a good idea it will amplify your idea your product or services to a wider audience and they are going to purchase your product or services so i always say though two things first thing is you need to define how you are going to make predictive sales how you are going to make that loan you took x amount of loan you took to 2x 3x 10x amount of money by generating predictive sales so you just show me the sales number just show me the roadmap and the system you placed in your business that's how you are going to make that much predictive sales second point is if you have some die hard fans for your product or services because you already launched that product so you must have some customers who are die hard fans of your product or services or your brand and you must have some micro influencer who are promoting your products or services to their audience so in this scenario what you can do you can do pre-sale also if you already have audience before launching out your product or services so you can use your existing audience to make them understand that you are launching some product or services which is going to solve out their challenges they are facing in their life and you can sell around 10k dollars of uh, product or services even before launching the product by using pre-sale method which will be sharing i will be sharing in my upcoming video so you need to do this thing to get some predictive sales and plus to get some pre-sales that's how you are going to keep up the money and i always say focus on making money making sales and proving your product people always think i need money to fund my business i need money to scale my business that's not how things works things works in a backward way money always follow a momentum if you are getting sales if you are getting leads if you are getting system in place in your businesses if you are proving your product and altering that product according to the market's demand then money will eventually come it will not wait and most people stuck that they want money to start off no things work in backward way and if you are truly customer centric person then no matter what happens you are going to rule in the market 
it in upcoming time so always try to please the person always try to focus on the person always try to focus on the feedback you are getting you must alter the product accordingly if you really want to make it huge i have a quick story for you i have a friend aj who was working in new jersey so first in the first he started out a magazine company in which he was printing out some magazines books and other things he ran that business he made some money but he shut down that business within 2.5 years of thing after that he started another business which was around some bakery stuff so he was doing pretty good in that industry and still after 3.5 years he made around 1 lakh dollars and shut down that business after that he was truly enthusiastic about the business so in the end he started a website company he, in which they are building up the website for the businesses and in that business he faced multiple failures in his seven years of business experience which built that aj the real aj who is master in the business segment so when he was doing the things he went through multiple failures in his journey he know when you are encountering this problem you need to solve it in this way when you are getting this problem you need to head in that way so that seven years of experience just polished that person who he is today and now he is making 10 million dollar profit every month in his business so most of the people feared of that i will get failures i will not able to make it on time i am not a perfect person for this business these failures will ultimately teach you how to go through the things and how to keep building to ultimately reach your goal so i always say entrepreneurship is not just the person who just want to do business or who just want to make some money the person who have some obsession obsession about the things just like i am the person no matter what happens i will do the business i lost multiple things i lost my family members i lost my personal life i lost a lot of finance is i lost some friends in my journey but nothing came up in my goals i always focus on my business journey i am creating videos i am helping my premium clients to dominate their market by using my 10x live domination services i went through multiple failures to become that branch of one who i am today that's a elite person so these failures ultimately gonna shape you up and that's how you are going to rule the journey by the way that's not a motivation video but it's really important that these failures are going to become uh, shape you who you are today i also got feared up when i lost my first business uh, i was building that business in the mid of my college and i was too happy i was making around 50k per month and it was too much to a college student who doesn't know the much about the businesses i lost that business i cried for whole two days but i learned that these things are not coming back so i started crafting another businesses i went into multiple segments i learned i help people i did multiple stuff so these are the things are going to shape you so before that subscribe to my youtube channel like this video and let me know in the comment section truly what you learned from this video how you are going to fund your business and what is the crucial part you learned in those two parts of the video how to fund your business because i am not just making these videos to get some views i really want to help you out if you have some queries please drop down your views in the comment section so i will understand that you are facing that money problem or any other problem so i can help you out with because i already consulted thousands of people across the globe so this is your chance i will be helping you out at free of cost but i want you to make understand i created a 10x elite domination program in which i helping you out to develop your personal branding to become elite in sales to develop a elite beast mindset and to use social media to explode your business with sales and die hard fans for this you can check out the link shared in the comment section pinned comment rest i will be helping you out in the upcoming video how to stack the deck up we know how to identify customers how to create a winning product how to fund your business now it's time to stack the deck up to get ultimate revolution in your business segment but before that you need to understand how to create a winning product for this was this video right now